Robert Mugabe has met the man who may spell the end of his 37 years in power, General Constantino Chiwenga. Mediators from South Africa and the Catholic Church have also met the 93-year-old president at his residence where the army has him under house arrest. The national broadcaster read out a statement from the military which says talks are making progress. In a statement, the ZDF said they are currently engaging with the Commander-in-Chief, President Mugabe, on the way forward and will advise the nation of the outcome as soon as possible. But Mugabe is reportedly resisting pressure to step down. And the pressure is growing. The return of a veteran opposition leader, Morgan Changarai, is another sign that suggests the end could be near. In the interest of the people of Zimbabwe, Mr Robert Mugabe must resign, step down immediately in line with the national sentiment and expectation, taking full regard of his legacy and a contribution to Zimbabwe. Changarai thanked military leaders for respecting people's lives in what so far appears to have been a bloodless military takeover. The former trade unionist tried to take on Mugabe in the past, but suffered for it. It's taken the split within Mugabe's own party, the ZANU-PF, to threaten his grip on power. The armed forces support the former vice president, Emerson Manangagwa, while the provinces and the influential women's chapter of the ZANU-PF have rallied behind Mugabe's wife, Grace. Tanks are still stationed across the capital, Harare, but people seem to be going about their normal lives, patient, peaceful, but also waiting for what comes next. Caitlin McGee, TRT World.